crosshead screwdriver to install them in order to activate the crown. Now, the crown comes with six forks. You load it up with the snack of your choice and the player that's hungriest goes first. You adjust the crown, you select your game mode, and you eat as many snacks as you can before the music stops. Then you'll pass the crown to different players and the person that eats the most snacks wins that round. Well, I have all the parts for Chow Crown Game laid out here on the table. I'll go over them right quick. We have our crown, our arm holder, our fork arms, the fork, the crown arms, and the front and the back of the crown. First thing you do is you'll need a Phillips it's crosshead screwdriver to insert your three AAA batteries. You unscrew it right here and right here. Battery goes here, here, and here. Put it back together. Next, we put on the arm holder. That was the only time you need a screwdriver, by the way, or any tool. Snaps into place like that. Then you assemble the front of the crown. I went ahead and attached the three jewels already to the crown. Now, if you look, right here, you'll see the arrows right here and right here. And they're right here and right here. So you just line them up, put it in until it clicks into place. There's little slots in there. So, just put it in. And, same thing with the back. You have two indicators. And, on the back you have two indicators. Now this goes right behind the front of the crown when you put it in. And you just put it in. And it also will click. And click into place. Next, right here on the inside, you see these. I don't know why they didn't just attach them, but you just pull them up and they snap into place. There's one on each side. Heard that one snap in. And one more. So once you figure it out, it really doesn't take very long to assemble. Next, we're going to take the fork arms and you attach a fork to each arm. Just snaps into place like so. I will tell you, I did practice this before I started filming. So, <laughs> I had a little experience ahead of time. Once you figure it out, it really doesn't take that long. Now, on our fork arms, there are indicators. So for the person that's wearing the crown, you will adjust the fork to the level of their mouth. So you can start here, but maybe somebody's mouth's a little different. So when you pass the crown, you just adjust that. Also, you'll see you have the strap to adjust it to their head. And the strap actually goes a little behind your head so the crown stays in place. So after you've assembled this, you're going to take the crown arm and you just put your fork in or your fork arm in just like that and it just goes down right there. It's very simple. I like this because there's no tools required beyond putting the battery. Now the child crown is assembled. <laughs> <laughs> He's stuck on to the phone. <laughs> so long, come on, so long. <laughs> 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 